We initiated development of Metal Gear Ray as a countermeasure to these pirated weapons forces. The only thing that can stand up to a Metal Gear is, of course, another Metal Gear. With Ray, the hundreds, if not thousands, of Metal Gears that exist Good. all over the world are no longer a threat. The blind rush to nuclear proliferation will be contained, and it will be the Marine Corps and our Ray that will accomplish this. At the moment, every industrialized nation on the globe knows the specifications for Metal Gear. Worse yet, so do a number of rogue states. They are all working on deploying their own Metal Gear force to compete with the U.S.'s nuclear strike capability. The world is about to see a swarm of these Metal Gear derivatives. Some say that the strategic importance of aircraft carriers will be reduced by the completion of RAID. The opposition from the Navy is an undeniable fact. There is a lot of pressure from Navy brass, especially those with submarine and air power. Not to mention interference from a major player. But this project is vital to the Marine Corps. The enemy is sometimes closer to home than you think, gentlemen. Always bear that in mind. This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear force will think twice about their nuclear strategy in the light of the military dominance spelled out by Ray. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order, and we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military. Ours is not the only military. So, any codec moments from you, Snake? Okay, first up... <laughs> this is hilarious! <laughs> this rules! But we can't use it. Get the shots we need! We need four images. One from the front... Terry project devoted to Metal Gear development. But it cannot be more different in nature.